the atmosphere was literally just raging. Um, the feel, I mean, my ears were just kind of going, going, going like, I don't know, there's so much crowd, crowd noise. Uh, I kind of had to put myself like in a little bubble. On the field it was kind of quiet, but everywhere else was really, really rowdy. And uh, whenever you're in that, you know, I'm thinking about a specific play, you know, the double play. And uh, that was a really big moment. You know, you got the fans on their feet. That game could have shifted quickly, you know. Uh, but uh, the team, they believed in all of us, and uh, we got it done. Well, speaking of the double plays, uh, you're going to have a new guy over there at second, most likely, um, with Ben Zobris. Uh, what do you look forward to getting to know about him and play with him? Uh, just like his attitude, his uh, preparation. I'm looking forward to see how how he, how he goes about his day and uh, how he approaches the game itself. Uh, we're going to have a lot of fun up the middle. He looks like someone that I could really get along with up the middle, and we're going to turn a lot of double plays and help out those pitchers this year. Have you heard about his nickname? I have not. Okay, so Zorilla is his nickname, okay. and I think Joe gave that to him. Do you know what a Zorilla is? Uh, I imagine a gorilla, but with Zobris' name. It's actually a, an African skunk, and it, it has one of the most powerful stinks in the entire world. Okay. Okay. You got anything? You I like it? I mean, I mean, I, I, well, I met Ben yesterday. He didn't stink at all, <laughs> um, but maybe, maybe his game overall. I mean, it doesn't stink, but maybe his game overall. It smell. I, I don't know. You got nowhere to go with it, right? I know where to I go know, with but it. He like liked it. He kind of takes pride in it. Like that's fine. Yeah, that's fine. So my nickname's Addy. It's a chick's name, but I roll with it. That's fine with me. With what? You guys did last year. You've seen the guys that are coming in now, the acquisitions from this winter. Uh, what are you most excited about in terms of where this club can take its next step? Just uh, playing against, uh, like, let's say Hayward or Lackey, and uh, just getting to know Ben just a little bit. I I could just tell that they want to win. They want to win. They want they want to break the curse. They're uh, they're all buying into the Chicago Cubs way, and uh, that's awesome. Uh, it's, awesome, it's awesome that you know that our manager has past experiences with the players that we got too. So, so it goes hand in hand. Uh, we're, we're looking that this year is going to be a pretty big year for us. David Ross has some hard feelings towards you, young guys, and he kind of feels like there should be a rule where y'all don't get to walk around with your shirts off anymore because you're making him look bad. We're creating a new rule though for for, for the team rule. It's shirts on all the time. They can't. These young guys can't be taking their shirts off. Okay, it's just embarrassing me with my love handles. <laughs> Walking around the, the clubhouse, I'm getting a complex at 39. That's a personal problem, I believe. <laughs> uh, no, I love Rossi, and and yeah, uh, I, I, I mean, I get where he's coming from. We look good, we look good. He looks good too for, uh, for Pops. I mean, I mean, he's a great, he's a great guy. He has high energy, I love his energy.